The Senate Committee on Agriculture visited National Agricultural Seas Council, Nigerian Agricultural Insurance Corporation, Veterinary Council of Nigeria, the Agricultural Research Council of Nigeria, and the Nigerian Institute of Animal Science. Chief Executive Officers of the agencies explained plans to explore opportunities in the agribusinesses but lacked adequate finances to perform optimally. To achieve the developmental roadmap of the Agri Ministry, the committee advised them to be proactive and innovative, as well as come up with amendment bills that will check unnecessary bureaucracy in their operations. The situation on ground may have raised concerns on how the federal government tends to realize its policy on economic diversification through agriculture. What is happening is really under the watch or under the nose of government. And uh, if the things we see here is anything to go by, our expectation is we will see worse things in terms of the situation, the state of affairs, you know, with the ministry. And uh, we have to face the reality. Meanwhile, a civil society group, Citizens Action to Take Back Nigeria, has joined the crusade in the Buhari-led administration's fight against corruption. This group has compelled here in protest for a while for the group the allegations of financial impropriety flying about in the National Assembly is undermining the nation's democracy and must be properly addressed. Our political leaders, particularly those we elected them, have the mandate to, to at least express their concern towards what the citizens are going through. But unfortunately they are not. So we are coming here to say no. These people must give account of how they spend this money being given to them. The protest convener says they will not vacate the National Assembly gate until the right thing is done. Kenneth Nanim, NTN News.